Hello everyone, Fleurfunk here, your trusted Tosca architect with dozens of years navigating the intricate world of Tricentis Tosca, from tackling tricky tests to mastering automation. I've been through the highs and lows, ready to share my insights with you. Have you got a moment? Join our Telegram community of over 2,000 Tosca professionals to connect with like-minded Tosca professionals, share tips and unlock exclusive content. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more in-depth guides and Tricentis Tosca tutorials. Your support fuels this channel's growth and helps us bring more Tosca wisdom your way. Let's unlock the full potential of Tosca together. Sorry about the background noise, my laptop is trying to take off. Now, onto a common roadblock many of you have faced, especially prevalent in my Telegram community. Ever clicked on your Tricentis Tosca workspace only to find it locked by another process? It's a frustrating hiccup that stops many of you in your tracks. But why does this happen? And more importantly, how can you fix it? Before I reveal the simple fix, let's think about what might cause the issue. Could it be network issues? simultaneous access conflicts, or perhaps Tosca didn't shut down properly last time. While these are all possible, the solution is often much simpler. Here's how you can quickly get back to your work. First, ensure that Tosca is completely closed to prevent any conflicts. Next, we'll dive into the system's heart and with some quick command line magic, open a command window and type in CD percentage sign tricentis underscore projects, close percentage, I'll put that on screen to navigate directly to your Tosca projects folder. We're not there yet. Let's go deeper with a CD Tosca underscore workspaces to find ourselves in the right spot. Now look for a .txt file that's locking your project. It's usually named after your project with a .txt extension. It's a lock file. Found it, delete it. And just like that, your workspace is no longer held captive by invisible forces. And there you have it. A simple yet effective way to reclaim your Tosca workspace. This trick is just one of many in the Tosca toolbox, and I'm here to share them all with you. Remember, our Telegram community is always open for questions, discussions, or sharing your own tips. And if you're a recruiter, all you have to do is buy me a coffee and you can advertise on the channel. And if you need a proxy for an interview because you're incapable of doing anything productive with Tosca, buy me a coffee and I'll allow you to find a professional who can actually do the job. And if this video helped you, give it a like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so that you never miss out on future Tosca solutions. Until next time, keep testing smart, not hard.